ucapan pro chancellor dengan segala hormatnya dipersilakan yang berbahagia Tan Sri Datuk Dr R Palan Thank you, Chairman of the Board of Governors, President of CUCMS, Academia, distinguished guests, parents, and the very reason for our presence here today, the graduating class of 2016. It's such an honor to be with you at your commencement from CUCMS, one of Malaysia's premier private universities. This day, I just want to share with you some of my experiences from my global journey, which I sincerely hope will help you to think about your journey. I only want to share with you three experiences this afternoon. The first experience. I grew up in Malacca. As a young kid, I remember standing on the sidelines of the Padang waiting to hear the first Prime Minister of Malaysia, the great Tunku Abdul Rahman, speak. His words I remember even today. Some people think as soon as you plant a tree, it must bear fruit. Do not forget, we must allow it to grow a bit. This is one lesson I learned and remember throughout my life. Every great person starts out as an ordinary person, puts in tremendous amount of energy and hard work before becoming extraordinary. Success came to Dato Sudirman after years of hard work. Dato Lee Chong Wei became a world champion after years and years of practice. Our very own Board of Governors of CUCMS, Yang Bahagia Tansri Dato Dr. Mani Jagadisan became a gold medal winning athlete with an unbeaten record after 40 years, only after running for a lifetime. As Tunku Abdul Rahman said, you have to nourish the plant for it to give you fruit. Life is such that you will have ups and downs, but the goal is to nurture your dreams and work your gut out for you to achieve your dream. When the great violinist Ehudi Menuhin heard a critic commenting that he was lucky to have had such great talent, he said, yes, if practicing for 20 hours every day for the last 25 years is lucky, yes, I'm lucky. Malcolm Gladwell in his famous book, The Outlier, talked about the 10,000 hours rule it takes about 10,000 hours of practice to achieve mastery in a field. As you leave university, as you leave CUCMS, I would urge you to remember there are no shortcuts to success. You have to master, and mastery comes after 10,000 hours of practice. The second experience, when I left university, I, I looked into the world for opportunities to make a living, to support my family who put me through college, just like your parents who put you through college. I was frustrated when I could not get the right opportunity. I sent out hundreds and hundreds of job applications, and when I finally got one, I did not like the location. And when I got the location, I did not like the company. And when I got all I wanted, I did not like the salary. It will never look like I will get what I wanted all. It was then a friend who reminded me of the Chinese philosopher Lao Tzu who said, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Today, you will take that single step out into the world. You have to nourish your dreams to achieve it. Work through with many small steps to arrive at your destination. 
Live your life by design, not by chance, said many great people. You determine your goals, follow them through, make sure you have a productive life. There will be few moments where you get everything you want. You just need to remember that every single journey begins with a single step. The third experience. The strange thing about life, you only understand it backwards, but life has to be lived forwards. We all make many mistakes. We need to learn from them and move on. Many of us comment what's wrong in the world, what needs to be changed. Just one has to nourish your dreams, start with a single step. We remember change starts with every one of us. The Indian independence leader Mahatma Gandhi said, you must be the change you want to see in the world. As one of each one of you graduate today and join the world of work, remember change starts with you. We need to have the courage to change the things that need to be changed for a better world for our children. Steve Jobs of Apple Computers said, if you live each day as if it was your last, someday you'll be most certainly be right. He said he looks into the mirror every morning and asks himself, if today was the last day of my life, would I want to do what I'm about to do today? And whenever the answer has been no, for too many days in a row, he said he, need, he knew he needed to change something. He always championed for each person to live his or her own life, not someone else's life. My final thoughts. You are here because of your parents. You are here because of your family. Remember them, thank them, love them, and make sure right after your graduation, go up to them, say how grateful you are for what they have done to you. Thank the dedicated faculty and teachers who have worked very hard to ensure your success. An institution is great because of the teachers, and we are grateful that CUCMS has a dedicated, sincere, loyal faculty that supports students' performance. Last but not the least, there's one thing that I've never forgotten in my life. When I started my life, I just bought this poster and I have it until today. And the poster is just this. When you have a dream, when you have a dream, don't let anything dim it. Keep hoping, keep trying. Keep hoping, keep trying. The sky is the limit. Good luck and all the best. Thank you. Happy graduation day. Krimakasi.